Love created me like itself. Love created me like itself. Love created me. Let's open to this. Okay. Today's idea is a complete and accurate statement of what you are. Today's idea is a complete and accurate statement of what you are. This is why you are the light of the world. This is why God appointed you as the world's savior. This is why the Son of God looks to you for his salvation. He is saved by what you are. We will make every effort today to reach this truth about you and to realize fully, if only for a moment, that it is the truth. To realize fully, if only for a moment, that it is the truth. That love created you like itself. In the longer practice period, we will think about your reality and its wholly unchanged and unchangeable nature. We will begin by repeating this truth about you and then spend a few minutes adding some relevant thoughts such as holiness created me holy, kindness created me kind, Helpfulness created me helpful. Perfection created me perfect. Any attribute which is in accord with God as he defines himself is appropriate for use. We're trying today to undo your definition of God and replace it with his own. We're also trying to emphasize that you are part of his definition of himself. After you have gone over several such related thoughts, try to let all thoughts drop away for a brief prepar preparatory interval. So after you've gone over several such related thoughts, Try to let all thoughts drop away for a brief preparatory interval and then try to reach past all your images and preconceptions about yourself to the truth in you. If love created you like itself, this self must be in you. And somewhere in your mind, it is there for you to find. You may find it necessary to repeat the idea for today from time to time to replace distracting thoughts. You may also find that this is not sufficient and that you need to continue adding other thoughts related to the truth about yourself. Yet perhaps you will succeed in going past that and through the interval of thoughtlessness to the awareness of a blazing light in which you recognize yourself as love created you. Be confident that you will do much today to bring that awareness nearer, whether you feel you have succeeded or not. It will be particularly helpful today to practice the idea for the day as often as you can. Love created me like itself. You need to hear the truth about yourself as frequently as possible because your mind is so preoccupied with false self images. Four or five times an hour and perhaps even more it would be most beneficial to remind yourself 
that love created you like itself. Hear the truth about yourself in this. Try to realize in the shorter practice periods that this is not your tiny solitary voice that tells you this. This is the voice for God, reminding you of your Father and of yourself. This is the voice of truth, replacing everything that the ego tells you about yourself with this simple truth about the Son of God. You were created by love like itself. We could just spend some time with him to really feel this lesson. So this lesson invites us to fully step back to let God relate through us, to let love be itself. We no longer need the self-concepts. We can afford now to step back into this love that we are. Gentleness created me gentle. Holiness created me holy. Love created me like itself. Anything else is an illusion and it can just be let go. It can't be needed. Mm. 
and Jesus said in, in the early part of the lesson that we can step back. We can even experience thoughtlessness, no thought. And the blazing light. This way we step away from time, future and past. We step away from plans. Into this being. Yesterday morning, we heard in our morning session here, um, it's over. The past is over. And Marie heard it in her mind, time is over. It must be if love created us as itself. We can allow it to be experienced, he said, even just for a moment. Even just for a moment. We can let that moment be now. Can you even say trust created me trusting? Yeah, sometimes we are sent on busy doings, all of us. And it's just an invitation to keep this in awareness. 
love created me like itself. He said in a shorter practice period, it's you are asked. He says it would be most beneficial, the most beneficial to remind yourself that love created you like itself in the shorter practice periods. It says four or five times an hour, or perhaps even more. This is most beneficial. Beneficence. <laughs> Hear the truth about yourself in this. It will be particularly helpful today to practice the idea for the day as often as you can. Particularly helpful today to practice it as often as you can. That's lovely. The right use of the word lovely. <laughs> and and try to realize in the shorter practice periods that this is not your tiny solitary voice that tells you this. This is not your tiny solitary voice that tells you this. This is the voice for God, reminding you of your father and of yourself. This is the voice for truth, replacing everything that the ego tells about yourself with the simple truth about the Son of God. You were created by love like itself. Thank you, everyone. Mm -hmm. Have a God morning. <laughs> Love created you like itself. That's the truth. <laughs> Bye for now. <laughs>